It was a fiery joke. Okay. <laughs> 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 also, yeah, you made Dr. Jiro really, really oh, happy. Oh, that was good. Destroy them all, but you're missing some of them. Destroy us all. No! What the fuck is that? What? Destroy us all. Dude, that's, no. from the Grim, that's from the Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy. Yeah. That's freaking Billy with his, his response about clowns. Clowns? Yes. Billy is like, Ow. Basically, Billy doesn't like clowns, and Billy's one of those people who's like, if he doesn't like something, it's the work of the devil, and he says all of this ridiculous shit about it, and he thinks okay. that clowns are gonna conquer the world or some stupid crap like that. Yeah, he'd be like, destroy yourself, and then he repeats that the whole time, and like the yeah, entire day. Like Isn't yeah, that from Invader stop. Zim? No, no that's that from. <laughs> I was gonna say! No. No, destroy us all! Destroy us all! Destroy us all! Okay, Fox, you're not the only one who had that uh, who had that same confusion. I had it too. Yeah, because the, the voice is so exaggerated. You're lying! It's the same no. actor. It's Richard Harvest. Same voice actor, yes. The guy who voices Invader Zim is also the voice of Billy from Billy and Mandy. Mm. Yep. I knew that. Okay, he voices Major Vim. Like, who, who else remembers all that stuff? I get off of all those old cartoons. How could I not? They're my childhood. It's like a room! That doesn't seem so bad. With a moose! Yes! Yeah. It, it, it doesn't seem that bad at all. Release the nuts! There's a. Why do I want that? Okay. I'm gonna need a basic rundown of what the fuck Deckard is talking about. So we've got a room and a mouth, and the room is now full of nuts. Well, I don't get it either. This sounds like the It was an Invader of Zim episode where oh. Zim tries to get rid of uh, Dib. Dib by launching him into space and into a black hole, which would lead him to a parallel dimension where it was nothing but a room with a moot. Ouch. <laughs> And he didn't I think it was so it. bad, but then he gave the moose walnuts. I don't get it. That was the point. It, it, that's exactly the point. It, it, you're not supposed to understand. Yeah. Like, it's the horrible. Is, that, is, the, you know? the, is, is, the, is the moose enraged by walnuts or some shit? Do the walnuts do anything? Are they poisonous? Does the it's moose... a visual gag, and it's also not supposed to make sense. It's like, does the room keep filling up with walnuts forever until it crushes you? Do the walnuts and the moose fuse into a moose nut? Nuts. That sounded a lot better in my head. Also, why did that walking tank have fucking heels? I don't Which know. So... Because them boots nuts? were made for. Because them boots were made for walking. And that's they were just walk all over you. <laughs> even, the, even these fucking old timey games have to push this. Oh, hey, you can totally do combat and heals. No, you fucking. Can't. No, you cannot at all. Even show I me, can bench. You can't. He's like, show me a re show me a woman in real life who can fight someone in heals with ease, and I'll show you the tr one true goddess of the universe. Because holy shit. You're just, yeah, you're like, cause you have to walk very delicately when you're wearing heels. I agree. I it's why really. I, it's, it's why like, we came to designing my character's battle outfits. I make sure they were not high heels. Yeah, this because you could, like, happen. you could angle it the wrong way. Why isn't that, oh, it's not exploded. Well, that was a waste of time right there. Yeah, Fuckers. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> I've never understood the appeal of heels, and I know the, you know, the common response to that would be, but you're a guy, so you wouldn't understand. I'm just like, well, yeah, I don't understand the concept of wanting to be tall and running the risk of actually killing yourself or breaking your legs.
just yeah. so you can feel a little bit taller. Because God like, damn! Once you die, he's like, let me tell you, once you die, you're gonna feel a hell of a lot shorter by about six feet. <laughs> and no amount of high heels is gonna fix that. If Questry guys is right about one thing, also make sure your high heels don't poke holes in the floor. <laughs> I mean, I will. I can only give one positive end about the use of high heels. Really? <laughs> I, I just, just follow me here. They can give a good kick. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Ah, my skin crawls. You gotta give the joke. <laughs> no, um, I've I've heard some stories. It's like I was watching this um I was watching this compilation of anime funny videos or anime meme stuff and there was a scene of Hi Bison Oh is hi Bison Is he about to uh, go into a super never mind <laughs> So that guy Ow like, fucker So that guy's and <laughs> anyway? He's one of the bad guys I mean, I get that, but he's like, he judo throws people, he does ginyu poses, he's got a jetpack. He constantly, hey, hey, like, he yes. constantly looks... Never I think mind, there's I'll one thing that needs to be that. said. Sorry. What is it that needs to be said? Wait for it. Did he leave? What? He did! I think he did! <laughs> oh, hi, Bliss! <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh my fucking god. <laughs> I caught you with my eagle eyes. Hi, Blissy. What the dick? The way he extended his leg. Damn it. He didn't even react. Let me guess. Bliss, did you secretly talk to Deckard and trick him, uh, me into being scared? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> the best. No! Do I have to play the whole stage? Oh my god. Oh no, I hate Orpheus, that. Orpheus, you stop! Oh no. Oh my god, that's gonna be a pain in the ass. Morpheus, you son of a bitch. Magical Star asks, ask all, who's your favorite video game villain? That's a tough one. Um. <laughs> Was that a Godzilla sound? <laughs> my ears. <laughs> it's a good thing I moved my head, but you. <laughs> I mean, it didn't scare me, but goddamn. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh my god. So was that okay? So was that the Blissey Dragon, Twink, or actual Godzilla? <laughs> I guess could say them all. Ow. I could Fucker. Say that a lot. Yeah, okay. in, resp in response to Magical Star Flash's question about favorite video game villains, since I've been playing a lot of Shadow of War, I have to say Sauron. He... Uh, I'm not sure. Okay, my favorite video game villain. Okay. I think that's what the question was. Yes, I'm thinking. Give me a minute. It's like I wasn't satisfied until I did a soundtrack. I'd say Rid- <laughs> I'd say Ridley. Ridley is a good villain character. I don't know what these people are talking about. They're asking... Uh, oh, okay, uh, Magical Star asked all of us who was our favorite video game villain. Video game villain. Uh, Y'all answer, I will think. Nice. Wouldn't you... Okay, Blissey, hey, wouldn't on, it be on. the aliens from Alien Isolation? The Xenomorphs? No, because I, I, no, I don't see them as villains. 
I was actually I was actually about to ask, do we do they have to be someone with evil intention? Because technically the aliens are just existing. Yeah, they're yeah. living things who do Terrifying obstacles when you think about it. Also, no it count... joke! Also, does it uh, count if the villain was in a movie before he was in a game? I think it has to be pure video game. Yeah. Damn it, I can't say song. Fuck. Thinking, thinking, thinking. I can't really think of anybody at the top of the head, of my head, other than what I'm playing right now, and that's Spyro Ripto Rage. I'd say Ripto's yeah. a pretty pretty decent evil villain. So yeah. is, uh, the sword Fucking blew up already! Game. God! <laughs> Rip does a good... Rip does a good... Okay, as for me, my personal favorite villain from video games is actually, um... People might be shocked at this, is Gita him from Skyward Swords. Get him! Get him! Lord... Lord Gira him! While he's my boy, he's amazing as a villain. Mm. He's like so flippin' flamboyant. It's creepy, but it's perfect for a character like him. Like, can I just say that Ripto of the ante against Nasty Nork? So Nasty Nork just turned all the dragons into stone. whoop de do. Uh, Ripto legit said, I'll kill you. Yeah. Also, uh, oh, I got another favorite video game villain. Kefka from Final Fantasy VI. Oh, yeah. Stop it, my skin cold. Uh, Derek, the, uh, the, the villain from Skyward Sword is known as uh, Get a Him. He is Get him! He, he, is, what a, he is a uh, underling under the main villain of the actual game. But you don't find out about that until way later. No, I have not played Alien Blackout because I'm not a fan of mobile games. Vati from Minish Cap. Um, okay. Thing is, I actually was impressed, but I think they the manga that the that they ba that the per creator based the uh, game from did a better job of explaining Vati's character more than the video game did. Honestly. Hmm. Oh, Darth Raven, that's a good one. Okay, Bellum from Phantom Hourglass, that is a really good villain. Ooh, perfect. Isn't there someone Ooh. you fight in isn't there someone you can fight in the Zelda games who when you fight him he straight up stops you from hitting him with your sword and just holds your sword in place? With his I, fingers? I don't think so. I don't know if there was ever that moment in the game. In any also, game. hi again, Bison. Oh, um, Joker from the Arkham games. I have to agree, that version of Joker was really good. Well, he's, but... he's voiced by Mark Hamill, so... Well, yes. Welcome to the Madhouse, Batman! David. I set a trap, trap and you spray glory! 